Welcome MTD friends, today I'm at AeroX booth and we're going to talk a little bit about all the products they have in here. But first let me tell you that as you may know, AeroX offers superior mist collection for all your machining applications and Eric is going to talk a little bit about the history of AeroX. So Eric, can you tell me a little bit about this company, please? Absolutely, thank you for that introduction. So AeroX has been around for over 20 years as a provider of mist collection solutions for uh, the machining industry. And uh, we have multiple product lines in those 20 years. We have uh, grown significantly. Uh, we're gonna talk about our product lines that are lined up here. So I'll start with the Aero. This is our premium unit. The Aero is designed as a machine mount and central system. These range from the smaller units at 400 CFM going to the big ones all the way up to 4,000 CFM. So these mist collectors feature fiber bed filtration technology and are designed to be a solution for both coolant, oil mist and smoke applications. How many stages does this unit has? That's a great question. So the Aero features between four and five stages depending on the unit itself and the application that it's designed for. So we work with our customers to make sure that they get the specific solution for their application. Okay, what industries does this unit serve better? Great question. So the Aero is used widely in metalworking industries, machining. So we're talking about our customers that are running mills, that are running lathes, Swiss screw machines. But we've also used the Aero outside of the metalworking industry. For example, for food production, we have a, a large customer that uh, makes frozen pizzas and they apply an olive oil to those pizzas. They utilize our Aero mist collectors to get that oil. How's, how is the efficiency of this uh, Mr. Col uh, sorry how is the efficiency of this mist collector very 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 good question so the efficiency of these goes all the way up to 99.99 percent on a particulate of uh, 0.3 microns so it goes through progressive filtration stages I'll show you right here so the contaminated air goes through progressive filtration stages ending up in our HEPA filter. The progressive filtration stages extend the life of the HEPA and these machines um, go without any service for up to four years. Yeah. That, that's great. Yes. And how long is the life of this product? Like how often does the people will need to change the whole unit? So we do offer a five-year warranty on it. Having said that, um, I recently visited a customer that's had the previous generation of this running since 2004 and that was the first time they had serviced it. <laughs> Those are a, long, a lot of years. Uh, is there anything else you would like to tell us about this Aero before we go to the next uh, unit? Absolutely. So as I mentioned, the Aero can be a machine mount solution as well as a central system. These range from 400 CFM, which is the unit we're looking at right now, and they go uh, in increments, they go all the way up to 4000 CFM, which are central systems. Um, many of our popular units for, for larger machines, smoke um, generating applications, would use the Aeros, um, some of the larger systems. So they're, they are very versatile and a great solution for almost any mist, oil, um, or smoke application. Perfect. Thank you, Eric. And I will go with my friend Kay, who is going to talk a little bit about the Misfit, that is a very compact unit. So, Kay, can you give me uh, the best features this compact Misfit has? Yeah, so the Misfit is our most popular mist collector, and the reason for that is because it can mount on virtually any CNC machines. So if you look right here, this is a side mount, but we have a lot of different mounting options. We have over 40 machine-specific mounting options. So that's amazing. Uh, if we had uh, several different machines, it wouldn't be a trouble to put one of these ones because we can adapt it, and we have the flexibility to put it in in the ceiling, in, in the floor, whatever we needed, yeah. right? Yeah, so we work with a lot of our customers to come up with our mounting options. Uh, the Misfit can go on virtually any machine. Uh, you can suspend it from the ceiling. You can, as you said, you can side mount it, put it on a stand. Uh, we do a lot of different mounting options. And can you tell me, like in the Aero unit we saw before, it has four to five units depending on the client requirements. How many stages do we have in here? Yeah, so the Misfit has three stages of filtration. So if we look here, these are our first two uh, non-consumable filters. These are mechanical elements. These do most of the work. It's going to kind of form like a fluid barrier. So the coolant or oil, it's going to coalesce into droplets and drop down right into the machining cabinet. 
Anything else gets caught by our third stage filter. This is a fiber bed depth loading filter. Average life on this is two years. This is the only consumable filter we have. Can you explain a little bit of how this works for me, please? Yeah, so the filter, um, these do most of the work. Anything else gets caught into these filters. So this is depth loading. Um, a lot of uh, other mist collectors use face loading. Uh, this a depth loading filter gives a lot more filter media uh, to catch all that mist or coolant. How, uh, which percentage can we uh, get in this filter? Like 99% as the arrow? Or how, how is the efficiency of this one? Yeah, yeah, so this is a MER15 filter. Uh, the HEPA is 99%, but MER15 is just shy of that. But that's a great question because we've made the Misfit modular in design, so we can add a HEPA filter on top. That usually works with like smoky like applications, so if you're experiencing smoke instead of mist, we'd add a HEPA filter on top. I have another question. On, okay, you mentioned before that we can use this uh, a lot with CNC machines, but as the size is very compact. Can we use it in any other industries? Yeah, so we've worked a lot with surface grinders. Uh, they're kind of like open-ended machines. So what we'll do is uh, we'll mount the unit either on the wall or wherever it's necessary, and we'll use suction hose to get as close to the source as possible. So it's our solution towards surface grinders. And we didn't talk about this, but I'm just saying it in here. This will let us know when we need to replace the filter of the stage tree, yeah, right? This will let you know when the consumable filter needs to be changed. We made it pretty simple, green good, red bad, right? Yeah, yeah it's pretty simple. Pretty simple yeah. Is there anything else I'm missing before we go to the next unit? Anything else you're missing? Um, I'd say, you know, we offer 30-day trials. So if you have a specific machine that's causing you issues with mist, try the Misfit out. Try the Misfit out, you know, you can directly mount it for 30 days, see if it solves your problem. If it does, keep it. If it doesn't, send it back. Perfect. Thank you, Kay. Thank you. I'm heading to the next location. Hi, Daniel. How are you? Oh, fantastic. Thank you very much for being here. Are you going to talk to me about the blow box, right? Yeah. How does the blow box work? What's the difference between the Aero, the Misfit and the blow box? Of course, that's a fantastic question. So uh, the blow box is actually not a mist collection uh, solution. It's essentially a parts blow off station. Now, uh, there are a few other products like that in the market, but what really separates us is the fact that we have an electric impeller in the unit. So meaning uh, there's no spool up time required. And so a lot of our clients, they will end up uh, putting down their parts into the, um, into the parts blow off station. They'll either use a a handgun to blow them off or we also found that some of our clients that run long operations let's say a 20-30 minute run within the machine they'll simply bring the part to the table and they'll let it down draft uh, simply carry the oil down uh, into the machine without spraying that oil within the facility or your, in your surrounding area now beyond that uh, there's another small but uh, small but effective uh, benefit to the machine is uh, if you actually just run this machine ambiently, there is a HEPA filter that works, uh, that is the second stage filter in this unit, and it will ambiently filter out and clean the air in the shop in your surrounding area. So this blow box has only two stages? That's right. So the first stage is what we call a demister element, and uh, as Kay mentioned, with a Misfit, you will find that same uh, demister element present in the Misfit 550. And that's going to be the first stage in the blow box. So if you look inside, that's exactly where you, where you will find it. Um, underneath here is our Rhino board, which is capable of holding up to 100 pounds of, uh, well, parts up to 100 pounds. And the second stage of filtration in this unit is a 95% HEPA filter. So we definitely expect to mostly service the CNC machining industry uh, with this machine. Now, um, I'm sure that there's a lot of uh, manual machinists out there that do also spray their parts with oil and they will find benefit with this product as well. It is very easy to use, right? Oh, 100%. All you have to do is plug it in the wall, turn the switch, turn the switch on, and <laughs> you're off to work. That's very easy. Before I go back to Eric, is there anything else I'm missing and that you want to add about this unit? I believe we covered it all. Uh, we do have a few um, very simple but nifty features on this unit. So if you look to the side here, we do have an air gun holder to the side to make it easily, uh, uh, well, to 
make it simple for you to mount your air gun on the side and keep it close to the machine. We've also incorporated a drain on the side here, uh, which will allow any kind of fluids that accumulate inside the machine to simply uh, uh, to drain them simply into a bucket. And if you want to reuse the coolant and oil over time, you might be able to filter it out as well. Perfect. Thank you very much, Daniel. So I'm heading back to Eric to do a small closing. And also, I would like to ask you, Eric, we already saw three units, but do you have any special applications as well? Absolutely, Anna. Thank you. And it's been great talking to you and your team at MTDCNC. So, AeroX has expanded significantly over the last 20 years to serve various industries. Obviously, the units that we talked about here are very much for industrial applications, but we also serve commercial applications. Uh, we have portable HEPA systems that are deployed to about 600 different schools at this point um, across Canada. And we've also um, gotten into the medical industry through uh, our new product, which is the fan filter unit. So those, uh, those units are ceiling mounted HEPA filters, they're utilized in clean rooms and hospitals alike. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure that the filters that go to the hospital has to be very, very high efficiency, right? Yes, absolutely. So the same as you would find in our Aero and our Misfit, we actually utilize certified medical grade HEPA filters in all of our systems.